Johnny, uh, an exit for us in the Papillon's Trophy tonight, but very much a game of two halves. How do you sum that one up? First of all, I'd just like to thank all the fans that, that came tonight. Unbelievable support. You know what I mean? Wednesday night, Plymouth away, Wednesday before Christmas. Got a chance to say thank you in person to a few of them before the game. So if I didn't, if I didn't see, I apologise for that. But uh, incredible for them. So yeah, dis disappointed that, that we've gone out tonight for those guys, but uh, really proud of the boys. The effort they put in. Um, we've had sickness going around in the camp this week. I like to send four lads home this afternoon because they went down overnight, and uh, so we were sort of on our last legs as far as our energy. And uh, we tried to pick a team that, that would give us as much as we could from the, from the off. <laughs> and, we, and we saw that, didn't we, in that first half? Where I thought we were magnificent, um, but unfortunately we just couldn't keep it up. And I think, uh, I think it showed in the second half. The energy levels obviously dropped. Uh, the boys, you know, the boys gave everything. Uh, again, come up against a really good team, um, and we took them all away. The Obviously, once he goes to penalties, it's a bit of a lottery in it. So, um, I'm, I'm, I'm proud of the effort, the performance. I'm disappointed that we've gone out, of course, but um, lot, lot, lots of positives to take as well. Yeah, some real mixed emotions as you've just expressed. Um, Obviously, highlight of the first half, Carl Hudlin getting two goals. Um, yeah. What was your sort of message to him after that? Well, I just thought in that first half we looked, you know, we looked, we looked like we had real energy about us. Uh, we looked to threat. They've had to change their shape to try and combat what we're doing. We scored some really good goals. Um, we, we could have scored some more. You know, we created some really good chances. Huddling's a threat. We worked on getting the ball wide, getting it to, to our wingers, and then being really positive and, and telling our strikers to, to stay between the posts and. Got it to Courtney in 1v1, he's produced a brilliant, brilliant bit of play. Ayub, Ayub's done it for a goal and, and scored one himself. So uh, we said if you know if we could if we could shut them out at one end that, that we fancied ourselves our front four if you like to go and win the game for us and uh, we put ourselves in a great position. Uh, obviously we, we couldn't hang on. Looking ahead to Boxing Day, do you feel like you'd look to change your team maybe again? Or do you feel like there were some players who put in performances tonight that Really, might make you think extra before picking. Yeah, the team. I mean, I saw some, I saw some really good stuff tonight. Uh, that's obviously giving me food for thought. Obviously, we're gonna have to see where we are uh, as far as, as far as this bug that's going around and, and the illnesses and how the lads that, that obviously I had to leave behind, how they respond and how the lads. You know, there was boys on the pitch today who, <laughs> who uh, weren't feeling great and you know they've had to play through it. So it's how they respond as well now. Over the next couple of days is going to be crucial. You know, to, to see where we go a bit uh, Boxing Day, so we see how they recover from this one. Um, it's going to take a bit out of them because it's a great effort, uh, and obviously, yeah, they're not they're not uh, in great nick. So, yeah, you know, hold fire on that one, and uh, we'll see where we go a bit for Newport.